What's going on guys? I'm here with some more NCAA Football 13 here today, debuting another new series on my channel, the Pac-12 Online Dynasty. If you remember last year when I started doing YouTube, I got NCAA 12, one of the first things I did was a Pac-12 Dynasty with other with another commentator, Lax Rocks Topher. He is the commissioner of this one, or co-commissioner, and we did not get through a full season last year, but it was a ton of fun with what we did, and just things got kind of hectic when people went off to college. But this year, the commissioner and co-commissioner are committed to making this at least three seasons long, and so I'm, I've been really looking forward to this online dynasty. I wanted to get another dynasty going with Lax Rocks Topher this year. I'm happy to see we got this back. Last year, I was Arizona State, and this year, I have jumped ship to the Washington Huskies. And if you remember the Jack Hammer live stream I did just a few days ago, I said I was going to be USC, and I was until I decided to change my mind at the last second because it's not like me to be the powerhouse, and I know Washington's still a pretty good school. I just didn't want to be the powerhouse. I kind of wanted the switch, and so I took Washington, who also have a very good roster. I got to go against Oregon and USC, two other very good rosters, and I know most of the players in the dynasty, and I think we're going to have a great time in this dynasty this year, and I hope you guys enjoyed the series as well. I'm only doing two dynasties, this one plus my offline UTSA dynasty. That's my rebuilding project and something I will be in for the long haul. And I've been really looking forward to dynasty in this game because I haven't really got into it in past games. This year I'm going all in. It's going to be dynasty hopefully until NCAA 14. And that's what I'm hoping anyway. And so you can see here I got into the game. I accepted my slot as the Washington Huskies. And now I'm just doing recruiting right away in the preseason, getting my board set up. I'm not showing a ton of recruiting, but I am showing some just to show you guys what I'm doing. And I'm not going to show all the scouting and the recruiting that I try to do, especially if I'm going against other players in the dynasty to get a certain prospect. I don't want to show my full hand. And so I'm showing you guys here some of the prospects I'm going after. Most of them are in my pipeline, but then I also did eventually go and look at the top prospects, the top 100, and I'll be fighting against teams like Ohio State and some of the SEC teams to get some higher prospects. I have a good roster, looking forward to a good season, hopefully. I've been looking forward to these Dynasty modes, and now they are finally here and debuted. And I think you guys are going to really enjoy it this year. So you can see here my board and some of the prospects I'm going after. I did write down all the starters I had that were seniors. And I'm going to have to end up replacing a fullback, a wide receiver, a corner. Uh, actually, two corners, a safety, defensive tackle, and a center. So a little more work than I have to do with UTSA in my first year. But Washington is a solid school. And I think I'm going to get some very good prospects. And I'll try to steal some guys from other teams that are looking at them, like Texas here is looking at this corner that I really want and I've been scouting. And so I'm just hoping that guys can get their games in very frequently. We only have like 12 teams to control, so it's pretty easy to manage, like six games a week or whatnot. Sometimes we'll have to play against a computer, and I will have to play against a computer in my first game against San Diego State. That one is against the computer. I should play it tonight and hopefully have it up tomorrow or the next day. Anyways, guys, leave a like if you're excited for the Pac-12 Online Dynasty. Looking forward to bringing you guys a lot of content for this series. And so thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.